I made a few dishes based on some popular Mondstadt recipes. This is no good hunter, but there should be enough to go around. Please, help yourselves. Wow, smells great. Don't mind if I do. Wait, don't steal all the fried vegetables. Leave some for me. Hey! Paimon's full. What a great meal! Albedo, you're too modest. These dishes are as good as anything you'd find in a top restaurant. Are all alchemists so good at cooking? Hmm. You may be onto something there. Right? Paimon thinks so too! It's his lab manner that gives it away. The kind of guy who holds a potion bottle as steady as a rock isn't the kind of guy who's gonna be slap dash with his salt and pepper. Actually, that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> I'm so sleepy after all that food. <sighs> Did Bennett fall asleep sitting up? <laughs> he must be totally wiped out. The way he's sleeping is so... alert. I'm impressed. He seems to be in a deep sleep. Ooh, Paimon wonders if he sleep talks. Uh. Oh, no, Dad. No apples for me. I want sticky honey roast and fisherman's toast. Sticky honey roast? That's your favorite, isn't it, Amber? Mmm, sure is. Give me a sticky honey roast from Good Hunter any day. I used to take Eula to Good Hunter a lot back when we first met. Before long, Sarah would start cooking our usual orders as soon as she saw us coming. She said we ordered the same thing so often that it was practically muscle memory by that point. <laughs> she also said that if everyone in Mondstadt ordered like we do, her job would be so much easier. All she'd have to do is memorize everyone's favorites. <clears throat> Always eating together. Ah, it's nice that you two are so close. The Traveler and Paimon always eat together, too! It's a sure sign of true friendship! Two people simply sharing a meal says nothing either way about the relationship between them. That depends if it's a one-off meal or a regular occurrence. Aha! Paimon just noticed something! Whenever Eula doesn't want to admit to something, she raises her chin or puts her hands on her hips! <laughs> ah, you've all picked up on that! Didn't know Eula's tells were so easy to spot. We are done here, yes. I am free to go, am I not? Then please excuse me. I have a frozen lake I need to be at. You're going for an ice bath at this time of night? W wait up! Don't go without me! I thought you wanted to get some sleep. So maybe you should stay here and rest. No, I should come with you. It's late, and it's dark, and you're not good with directions like I am. Come on, let's go together. An ice bath? Oof. Rather them than Paimon. So much... roast meat. Oh, hey, Dad. I'm doing alright. I'm a leader of my own adventure team now. Wow. Ben, it really is a sleep talker. Okay, looks like we got some downtime now. All right, you two. Time to paint. Have you decided what to paint? <laughs> like you even need to ask. It's obviously going to be Paimon. Sure. But we should move elsewhere. We're likely to disturb Bennett's sleep if we stay here, so let's go outside. Okie dokie. All right, grab your easel, paper, brushes, and paints. Don't leave anything behind. Ah, <sighs> 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 hey, 
Hey, Paimon, no, don't touch that. What the heck? Don't touch that mechanism or you'll fall down. Oh, well, never mind. Uh, what the heck is this guy dreaming about? <laughs> 